Hello and welcome. In this tutorial, we'll cover how to track progress on projects. Once you set up projects and your team starts tracking time, you can see how things go along by checking the status on the projects page. You can see how much time and money was tracked on each project. To get a more detailed breakdown, click on some project's status. Here, you can see a more detailed summary for this project and below a detailed breakdown by task. To track progress, you need to first set estimates in project settings. You can set estimate in time or by budget. When you select time, you can define overall time for the whole project or define estimate for each task individually. And when you select budget, you can define overall amount for the whole project or set amount for each task individually. Once you define an estimate, you can see project's progress in its status tab. Here, you can see how much time and money was tracked and how much remains. If you've set estimates by task, each task will have their own progress bar too. If you have recurring estimates or work on a retainer, you can enable reset each month and the progress bar will reset to zero each month and take into account only the current month's track time. Back on the projects page, you can see the tracked versus estimated status for each project. You can sort projects by tracked time, amount and progress. For example, you can sort by progress and all the projects that are over the budget will appear on top. If you wish to be notified of when a project gets close or overestimate or budget, you can set up email alerts in workspace settings. There you can set alerts, choose at what point you want to get alerts and who gets them. Then you'll get an email when some project or task goes over the estimate. Once you're done with some project, you can archive it here. Once archived, it will no longer clutter your project page and your team won't be able to select it and track time on an inactive project. To see your archived project, change to archived and click filter. If you've accidentally archived a project, you can restore it here. Archiving doesn't impact track time. The time for archived projects will still appear in reports and you can filter by them by selecting archived in the filter dropdown. You can also delete archived projects. This won't delete time entries on them, but it will leave them without a project. You can also archive clients and tags you no longer need. And complete tasks so they don't get in the way. They won't be available for tracking, but the data will remain unchanged. You can also add project related notes to projects in the notes tab. You can add simple text and even apply some formatting using Markdown. For example, you can add links by using brackets like this or make something a headline by putting a hashtag like this. Then when you're finished editing, it will appear as a headline. Thank you for watching and be sure to check out our other videos as well as like, share and subscribe.